is maturing is when customers start demanding that it works with the other things that they have. And that's not true just for backend systems or underlying platforms or data stores. It also holds true for front-end technologies and tools. I've heard uh, from a number of more advanced adopters of process mining technology over the past year or so that although they find it delivers really, really significant benefits when used properly, they're also frustrated that um, insights from process mining tools are delivered within proprietary visualization and exploration front ends. They use Tableau or Click or Power BI or SaaS or something else for customer analytics, financial analytics, supply chain analytics, and more. Why can't they use it for process analytics? So when Salonis announced this week that it acquired the Process Analytics Factory or PATH, I wasn't uh, entirely surprised. PATH was a small German process mining specialist vendor that focused exclusively on providing its analytics within Microsoft's Power BI. Through this, it uh, also had a strong story relating to the broader Microsoft Power Platform and Office 365. The company was founded in 2014 and had around 40 employees and just over, I think, 70 customers. Now, according to Bloomberg, Silonis paid a cool $100 million uh, in a mixture of uh, cash and stock for PATH, which is remarkable, I think, given PATH's size. I don't have any insider information about PATH's 2021 revenue, but I would guess it would be something around four to five million euros. So a hundred million price tag is, I think, another really strong indication of just how hot this market is at the moment. The acquisition was actually completed a little while ago, and the two companies have already built uh, a strong working integration between Solonis's and PATH's products. Now, with PATH now, which is the PATH product, uh, Solonis gains a valuable new route to market for its Execution Management System, or EMS. IDC data shows that Microsoft's, uh, Microsoft currently leads the BI market overall with around about a 16% share by revenue in what is a, 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 a very kind of diverse market. And Microsoft itself uh, asserts that over 95% of the Fortune 500 already use Power BI. PAF only had a small number of customers and they were quite heavily concentrated in the dark region. But of course, Salonis now has a formidable global sales and marketing cap capability and a lot more money that it can throw at that to continue to grow it. And Salonis is clear that this is, this is just one step that forms part of a larger strategy, which is to integrate its EMS into a whole range of popular analytics environments, as well as workflow and automation platforms and backend systems. And the company has announced what it calls Salonis Experiences, which are specific entry points into the EMS that are focused on specific front-end platforms. As Salonis itself says, this is about bringing the power of Salonis's EMS everywhere to the systems and tools that our customers already know and use. PATH provides the underpinning for the first of these experiences for the Microsoft environment, and it's safe to assume that we'll see other announcements along this uh, same path before too long. Of course, all of this work is about lowering barriers to entry for Salonis, removing reasons for prospects to push back or delay or complicate sales conversations. Salonis has really, really ambitious goals for its growth and making Salonis solutions more accessible and easier to adopt is going to be absolutely crucial to the success. The market for process mining technology is continuing to evolve insanely fast, driven in large part by venture capital and private equity. And as things stand, process mining appears to be evolving into a feature bundled into larger platforms rather than a standalone uh, product proposition. Although uh, it's possible that there may continue to be just a small handful of viable standalone specialists uh, in this space in the medium to long term. But even if and when 
uh, process mining is subsumed into broader platforms, it will remain a strategically important software technology that shapes the universe of digital transformation and business automation possibilities. Thanks very much for watching. And if you enjoyed this, please like and share and subscribe. And I will see you all again very soon. Take care.